shadow play is very much like film, but it's live theater. It comes from an ancient tradition that started in Asia over a thousand years ago. Shadow play holds great potential for those who like any type of art. There's fine arts, designing, carving, and painting characters. There's theater. with acting, drama, special effects, and story. Eels? You can't get high heels in Sutherland. You can't even get underwear without driving to Burbank. The residency unfolds as the artist takes the audience behind the screen. And now the story moves to the Warner Grand Theater, where we are about to discover the art of shadow play. So you need a screen, you need a lamp, and you need characters. And, and then the magic can begin, because there's things you could do in shadow that we can't do in real life. Ah, ah, ah. I am the Lord of Shababa. You venture into my realm. Hands-on classes begin with making a simple character on cardboard. You know if you're doing it right, if you hold it up to the light, you can see light coming through it. Next, participants make a more complicated character on rawhide. Now here, it's a little different. Maybe we want to go dot, dot, arrowhead. And this would be dot, arrowhead. An odd number of scenes works the best, so like an opening mm -hmm. and a closing. So those are going to be given, and then right. three or five in between those two. We begin writing a group story in our first class. This is the ground. So when I bring the character in, I bring her in and I see where her feet are. I don't want to come in like this because it looks like she's walking in quicksand. And, and make sure he touches with his face, right. his profile. Students learn how to manipulate characters. A shadow screen is set up for each class so everyone can practice. Nice, Laura. My! Will you look at those chickens now? They're acting so weird. We better check out what's happening. Remaining sessions are devoted to finishing the group story along with the script, finishing the characters. Next, we combine our choreography with the live musical accompaniment. The residency culminates in a performance and exhibit of student work. Friends and family are invited behind the screen after the play. They can see the characters up close and even try their hand at manipulation. Because she's been doing these 
and residencies for quite a while, but she did one at my art center. And it was such an incredible experience for the participants, because not only do they get uh, 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 an experience or a knowledge with an ancient tradition, but, but they get the full thing. They re write the show and make the puppets, and then at the end they get this wonderful performance. But that's a lot, that's all due to Maria. And Maria's process of making these shows together. It's just a wonderful thing. So.